In this tutorial, we will show you how to use Python in Xcode. For this tutorial, we will be assuming that you already have downloaded and installed Python in Mac. So let's start by first launching the Xcode application. Once the welcome screen appears, click on the Create a new Xcode project option to get started. Now you'll be required to choose a template for the new project. Over here, we will choose the External Build System option in the Other section. In the next step, just give your project a name, and do remember to specify the bin directory of Python in the Build Tool field at the bottom. To see where the Python's bin directory is present, just open up the terminal application, type which Python, and hit Enter. You can copy the complete path from here only. Moving on, you'll be required to specify the location where the project is to be saved. For now, let's just save it to the desktop. Now we need to prepare a specific scheme that would allow a file that we're working on later to be passed to the Python interpreter. For that, we will need to go to the Product menu, move over to Scheme, and click on the Edit Scheme option. Make sure you're in the Run section, and over here, open up the Info tab. Now since we need to connect to the Python binary, we will open the Executable menu and click on the Other option. Now all you have to do is locate and select the Python executable file, and that's it. After that, do remember to choose the None option for Debugger. Next, open up Arguments tab and just type the file name with the .py extension under the Arguments Passed on Launch section. Once you're done with that, open up the Options tab and select the Use Custom Working Directory option. Over here, we will specify the same location where we saved the project earlier. With that done, we're basically finished with editing the schemes. Now let's create a new empty template to work on. Here, specify the same file name in the Save As field, which we specified in the Arguments tab. Do remember to tick on the checkbox next to the target file over here and click on the Create button. Now we will simply print text on the screen. For that, we will use the print keyword along with the message that is to be printed. Now let's run the code and see how it appears in the output. And in the window below, you can see that the text we included in quotes is appearing on the screen as the output. That means we are now successfully using Python in Xcode. And that's it. Thanks for watching. This was a howtech.tv tutorial.